A video going viral online shows a hidden skimmer on a convenience store card scanner in Fresno. Now, those skimmers aren't all that new, but they are very advanced. Fox 26 reporter Marie Edinger spoke with a worker at another convenience store who experienced the same ordeal, and he explains those bogus card readers take just seconds to install. Fresno police say a lot of the time crooks will try to distract clerks so they can install skimmers, and that's exactly what happened here at the food shop. A worker here told me that a woman called him over to the coffee maker saying she needed help while a man she was with installed a skimmer. Surveillance video from last year shows it only took a few seconds for this man to install a skimmer on the store's card reader. Perwindergill says Fresno police told him that same couple hit two other stores. They were clearly experienced. They didn't park here, not even in the back plaza. They parked right across the street. So we couldn't get their number plate. I could only get the car. Gill found the skimmer right after that couple left. The food shop is in the habit of checking their gas pumps and clerk stations for devices. We check it outside too um, in the early mornings. And in the store, we do it a couple of times a day. Yeah, be careful, y'all, look. Now, look. video is going viral of another skimmer. This one at 7-Eleven near Shaw and Golden State. You see where we at? People commenting on we social media Golden seem State, to think yo. the store owners Golden or clerk State, are responsible for putting yeah. it there. Over here stealing people's information. Gil says he doesn't know the owners of that 7-Eleven. But he says when he saw those comments online, he got so upset he stayed up until three in the morning trying to reply to people and show how the skimmers are actually installed and who is really doing it. What were you hoping to teach people by posting your own video? It's, it was just telling about like, there's not the owners are, aren't doing that. It's just the people that are coming in scammers. The operators of the 7-Eleven couldn't do an interview because 7-Eleven is a corporation, but they did tell me they are not the ones who put the skimmer there. Fresno police backed that up too. Sergeant Martin Van Overbeek with the Fresno Police Department's Financial Crimes Unit told me, despite some of the negative comments on the business and employees, it is highly unlikely they knew the device was present. The Fresno Police Department did send over a few tips to help keep you safe. One is that you can, of course, always check for the skimmer yourself. If you're going to be paying with a card, make sure to always hide your PIN number and set up account alerts so that you get a text or email anytime that card is used. You could pay in cash or if you do suspect fraud, make sure to call the number on the back of your card rather than Googling a number and calling one you find online because that could be a scam too. In Fresno, Murray Edinger, Fox 26 News. Sergeant Van Overbeek said the skimmers used in these cases are extremely sophisticated. He says they capture the card number and your PIN, store the information, then send it to the scammers over Bluetooth.